This portion, this portion of Claudia will go over how to schedule an appointment and use mapping and calendaring features. First thing you want to do is open up your lead, double click on it to open it. And if you want to schedule an appointment to go out and demo or list some equipment or to follow up, just come up to the top tabs. Next to correspondence, there's an appointments tab. Left click on that and then come up to the top highlight the add icon left click on it and you can now schedule an appointment and maybe you want to do a demo that would be the subject of the appointment location 900 Swift Road and the start time just left click on the start time open up your map and we'll do it tomorrow and it automatically is going to show the time that you're currently at so to change the time just left click in that time box and backspace or delete enter your new time three o'clock hit done by default it's going to schedule one hour if you want to change that just left click in the next time and maybe it's going to maybe you need an hour and a half just do 4 30 done it will send you an email reminder and go ahead and hit, uh, you can put some notes if you'd like, and then hit save. Uh, appointment su saved successfully. Go ahead and close. And we'll close that. And now we'll go down to the calendar feature. Underneath leads, the bottom left, you'll see calendar. Go ahead and left click on your calendar. And it'll open up by default to the monthly view. Bold will be the day you're on. And it'll show all your appointments that you have scheduled for the month in Claudia with your leads. And this is only for leads that you schedule through Claudia. And if you want to look at the week, left click on week. You want to look at just the work week. Don't want to look at Saturday and Sunday. It'll break it down by appointment, by day. And if you only want to look at the day, then it's by the time frame of the day. So if you want to click on week and print that for the week, left click on the print tab and there's your print ready schedule for the week. So that is how to schedule appointments and schedule demos in Claudia. The nice feature is it will uh, remind you and send you an email to remind you of your appointment. Next, we'll go back to your leads and show you a couple other features you have in uh, Claudia that you can utilize with your lead. Double click on your lead and open it. So you have this lead. If you want to map quest it, you can immediately come up in this lead and you'll see map. Hover over it, left click, it'll immediately open up Google Map and map quest and pull up a Google Map of that address with a little symbol right where it's at. You want to scroll in, take a better look at it, you can. And that's a nice feature because um, you don't have to go separately to Google Maps. Go back to the lead. Maybe you want to verify his phone number. Left click on white pages. And this is clearly a bad phone number and a dummy name. So it's going to give you a, a bad result. But if it was a real person, it would give you um, alternate phone numbers if he had any available on white pages. Go back to the lead. And we'll do a Zaba search. If he is a real person and a real business, you can come up here and left click on Zaba. It'll pull up the business information that's registered for that person as well. Um, that can sometimes be handy. So all three of those features are available on every single lead, which is a click, quick click of the button. So map, Zaba, and white pages. And again, to schedule an appointment, left click on appointment, left click on add, and add new appointment. Now what you'll see is on your leads, you'll see uh, you've got lead number, date received, the source of the lead, equip site, type of the lead, it's forklift, first name, last name, age, that's in case you want to put somebody's birthday in and wish them happy birthday. Um, theoretically, uh, you may use it, but you may not. Some, some people will use it, some won't. You don't have to. City and state of the lead. Last communication, this will at a glance show you the last time you communicated with that person. And then next appointment, 
this also shows you when your next appointment with that person is, whether it be a phone call or a face-to-face -face, face -face appointment. So that's another uh, feature that will give you kind of a snapshot right there.